These majestic trees are the national icon of Lebanon. But up in the Lebanese mountains, the cedars are facing a new threat caused by global warming. A tiny insect eating away at their pine needles. Nabil Namer has studied these ancient trees for more than two decades. If we look at the branches of this tree, we see that the majority of its pine needles have been devoured. We can see tiny little needles that are growing. In one year, if these needles are eaten, the tree will be completely naked and therefore in spring it won't have enough energy to make new needles. Nabil has observed the plague spreading year in, year out. 7% of the trees in this forest are dead and more than 70% are affected. Next summer, it is certain we will find this tree completely dry. In the earth, just a few centimeters under the trunk, the pest lies. These little green larvae are those of an insect which lay their eggs in the cedars each spring. Normally, the larvae devour the needles before taking refuge in the earth to hibernate for three to four years. There is not enough humidity in the earth, so these insects are now emerging every year. Sometimes we find 600 larvae per square meter. It's a great danger because all the larvae will come out of the earth, not just a few of them. To save the cedars, using pesticides is no longer an option. Reforestation operations are multiplying. In this natural reserve further south, dozens of scouts have come to plant some 300 cedars. The most important thing is not to put large rocks on the roots. Driving the project is Magda Boudaguer and her association, Juzul of Nen. There are other dangers that threaten the cedars. For example, in regions of altitude, there's a lot of private land. Plus, with the rise in the population, people are building. So the regions where the cedars could naturally spread and the forests could connect are being built upon. In less than 20 years, the country has already lost more than 3,500 hectares of forest. Faced with the crisis, the Lebanese government has launched a very ambitious reforestation program to replant 40 million trees throughout the country.